Welcome back to Rock U, where music is easy and fun to learn. Once again, I'm Jake Crowell, and today I'm going to cover Cochise by Audio Slave. All right, so this is the, the chorus of the song. It's on the crash cymbal. Like I said before, typically you usually have, in a rock tune, two and four in the snare known as the backbeat. But in this groove, he adds also the three on the snare as well. As far as the bass drum's concerned, so you're gonna play one and on the bass, just to start it off. For beat two, you're gonna play the E and, so right after the snare. Two E. So the first two beats, one and four. One and three, four. So we add beat three to this, he plays the E and the uh. It's basically eighth notes, but you're displacing it a sixteenth note. And the last thing we need to add is the and of four on the bass leading in back into beat one. So without the crash cymbal, I'll play it just bass and snare. One, two, three, four. So there will be three eighth note bass drums in a row, starting from the and of four to the and of one. Also, last thing, you want to play the second crash with the left hand on the downbeat of every measure. And just like every hard rock groove you're going to play, you want a loud backbeat. If you don't know what a rim shot is, it's when you play the rim and the snare at the same time. Because you're playing a big rock concert, you don't want any of that weak stuff, right? You want a loud backbeat. Play for the guy in the back of the room. So anytime you play a loud rock tune, remember that. Thank you for joining us here at Rock U. I'm Jake Crowell. See you next time.